In this video I'm going to show you how to make a quick apple in Blender. Right. We want to go over to Spanner and find this one here. Right. And being in object mode, we want to subdivide it. One, two. And let's go into edit mode. Uh, I'm going here, and let me put this on. All right now, you can see what I'm going to do down the bottom. All right, so I'm going to add two cups and uh, and uh, scale them up so they're ready to be selected. And hit said if you put the cuts in separately and it deselected one, you want to go around and select it. Uh, uh, not quite right. And we want to add one along here and I enter. Oops. We want to scale that out a bit. And see the same thing this side. Let's X this guy out that way. And I want that one around here. Let's scale that out. Right, I'm going to hit one five and go on to vertex mode. Uh, hit Z. Go into um, wireframe mode so I can. See through object and select multiple um, targets. Uh, right there, I just hit B and drag. Just uh, them out a bit. Yeah, five. Uh, somewhat looking more like an apple. Uh, oh yeah, film wireframe. I want to come out of that. Select the bottom ones. Drag them down a bit. Scale them in. Looking more like Apple. Oh, well, yeah, I just, I just, oh, you don't have to copy what I'm doing there. All right, I did, all I did was move that and I like that thing being in the center. All right. And I think I had to sync, sync, yeah. Uh, all right, okay, mess some things up. All right, select these, that mode. All right. Scale them in. Hit E to extrude zero so it isn't going anywhere. And I scale them in. Bring that down. And scale that in. Bring that down a lot. Right. Now, what we want to do is add a loop cut, Control R. Put a loop cut there and again in top mode there we want five All right and not we're not in wireframe mode at the moment just letting you know just in case you think we might be right. so if I want to scale these and a bit as they too far out from my likings uh, come out of five mode uh, Scale in, plop, uh, I want to select the bottom one again. You can spend a lot of time on this, uh, try and get it perfect. Uh, at the moment, I'm just roughing it out. Uh, go and hit it. Said, let's go up on the said. Let's go down in. It said, let's go down in. It's trying to look more like an apple. Right. And now I just want to add some. No, don't want that. that. Right. That thing can go back a bit. Came from. 
uh, do select some random points and bring them down a bit so apple isn't quite perfect you've never seen a perfect apple bring them up like that. and now if we go into um sculpt mode and we go into what we're going to do yeah. bulk it out a little bit because it's kind of I mean, apples are kind of weird down the bottom and then what we want to do uh, hold uh, I think it control yeah hold control and add a little indent there tab uh, down here on this end bar I'm going to click actually I'm going to go into the face mode select that thing and click smooth it's smooth uh, and uh, it's starting to look a bit more like an apple I uh, want to smooth things out a little bit around here as well though so, they're looking a lot more like an apple all right, now I'm going to go into object mode. Click on cylinder. Don't don't do anything to the cylinder yet. What we're going to do down here is change this to uh, ten. Yeah, ten, ten, good enough for me. Uh, I don't like end guns at all. I prefer triangles over end guns. So I'm going to put them on triangle. And now we can hit tab, go into edit mode. Scale down, pull it up so I can see where it is. Alright, scale it down and then we scale it along the Z. Right, you can leave it pointing straight up if you want, but in my eyes, I've never seen apples doing that. Not quite. And so you can add a loop cut here, loop cut here. Yeah, uh, probably get oh, wireframe mode. Um, take a next. Uh, gonna delete the bottom. And when you hit delete, you want to delete first text if you selected the, the little dot icon down there. If you selected the edge, you want to delete the edge. If you selected the face, you want to delete the face. Uh, and it isn't quite an apple. So we drag them down a bit. And we're going to hit R, and I can see down here uh, the blue is said, X is red, and I'm guessing it will be Y. I want to rotate around to Y. Okay, it's going to let me. R, Y. Okay, now it's going to let me. <laughs> right. So move that over a little bit. Uh, rotate this a little bit. R, Y. Uh, add another loop cut. Uh, no. Uh. Oh, why? Let's go that down a bit. Uh, let's down a little bit and just go this down a, twid, a teeny teeny bit. Right. Right. Come out five mode, come out Wi Fi mode. Right. So, yeah, that's there pretty much. All we want to do is go back in edit mode, go into face mode, hit A to select all, smooth. And there, uh, we got Apple. In the next part, I'll show you how to unwrap it and texture it. I hope this um, tutorial is useful.